Love, it's the beating of one's heart over and over again. It gives you moments of pure joy and bliss. The feeling of looking out onto the ocean with the soft sand between your toes. A brilliant sunset with all the colors of the rainbow setting in front of you. The warm sun so pleasant on your face while the cool breeze plays with your hair. That is a feeling that love gives you. It is an overwhelmingly beautiful thing that can only exist in nature. You cannot force real love because it only occurs naturally. Like the turn of the seasons, there is nothing you can do to stop it. It is also a thrill. The butterflies you constantly feel in your stomach, going almost straight down from the top of a roller coaster and feeling your heart drop in that moment. It is the tingle you feel in your skin when their hand brushes yours and the butterflies that never truly leave your stomach. The, the thrill of something new and exciting. It's also the feeling of home and family, the comfort you feel when you're with them, the look in your eyes that says family, the feeling that makes you want to spend the rest of your life with a single person. Love, there is nothing like it. There's nothing more beautiful and nothing more painful, but it's what we live for and it's what we fight for and it's what keeps us alive. Yesterday, Sufi came into our lives, and the first breath he took was with his eyes wide open. I remember me and Lucas overwhelmed with his smile. From a young age, you were determined to conquer the world. You knew what you wanted and were determined to go and get it. From a baby to a boy, from a boy to a teenager, from a teenager to a man, and finally from a man to a husband. In December 2014, I remember we were looking for Christmas presents and we entered Danier, the letter shop. And there she was. The lead was managing the store at San Vital. I remember like it was yesterday. She captivated me in Lucas' eyes. We started talking and we asked her, do you know my son Zufi? And her answer was, who doesn't know Zufi? Today is the day to rejoice in knowing that our dreams for you have come true. We would like to welcome the lead in, into our family, into our hearts, in our home. We love you so much. Sufi, you have chosen a beautiful young lady as your bride. The lead, please take good care of our beautiful Sufi. This is the day of making memories and to celebrate your love for each other. Make each memory count. Be generous to each other and know how to embrace good and bad days as long as you do it together. Your dad and I have this greatest love story of all. We are together for 35 years and shared tremendous amount of experience in love and we would like to say With pride and excitement, we see Dalit and Suf creating a new family today. Family is a nest for loving people, where they warm each other, support each other, guide each other, share good and difficult, find understanding and help. Dalitush and Tsuf, you are guys so good together, you are the perfect match. Some say it is enough to have one in the family who is ambitious and motivated to make a very successful, but you guys are both very ambitious, <laughs> highly motivated, are not afraid of any challenges and looking for new goals to achieve. So we can't wait to see how incredible you will become together as a family. And it now gives me great pleasure, by the power vested in me, by the province of Manitoba, to pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, that will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. 
for yours the kingdom and the power and the glory, the Father and the Son, the Holy Spirit, now and forever and unto the ages of ages. Amen.